actually because my husband bought me your book because he knows this is we we're, we're not this is how we like to do things but we didn't know um it's cuz he bought it for me bless him and um i read that book and i just thought oh god there is an alternative thank thank goodness for that and um but i was very you know that it was put upon me like surgery was probably my only option and um speaking to you um that day it was like the first time really to have somebody who's been there and been in a worse you were in, you had even you had adenomyosis and you know so much more severe and you did it all by yourself and i, I it just gives it gave me um the courage i would say and um to see that you've come through it and you're doing this now helping all these other women i was like i can do this you know to have that support it was it it gave me that um confidence to go forward and to see there was another option so if that book wasn't out there um i would have found myself in a very difficult situation i feel i fear that i would have found myself feeling like that was my only alternative which would have only made things worse <laughs> that first part of the program where it's not happening quick enough <laughs> for us all <laughs> and we're all like oh but i'm still feeling this i'm still feeling that and you remind us you're where you meant to be and it's a different way i suppose of understanding that the body gives us pain because it's got to that stage where it's been trying to tell us something and we've not really listened so now it's poking us <laughs> um, <laughs> Yeah, the emotional part is to any any woman that thinks they don't need that bit. I would say that bit is the crucial bit. <laughs> it's the most important part. And if that's ignored, then I don't think it matters what we do because we are blocking any our bodies from absorbing any goodness if our emotions are not listened to and heard because we're basically saying I don't want to know myself. If I mean, it, it really it is quite fast, isn't it? The change is when you look that that's been there for so many years. Um, and yet in my household over the changes, it's almost been subtle in that we've really not given those changes. The, I don't feel mm -hmm. the respect that they deserve, actually. Um, when I think back to my last month of where I've not had any pain between any of those symptoms between periods and then I have a period and all I have is like moderate discomfort <laughs> I feel a bit choked up in the sense that I've I was that ill and yet six months down the line I've been quite hard on myself still I see through like you said I hope you celebrated those three days well not to the I didn't give the celebration the degree it deserved actually um and I feel um, I feel actually, I feel actually, it's shown me how hard I am on myself yeah. because it, now I am so much better. But yet I'm still hard on myself. <laughs> but I can, um, I can thank that part because I know that that part's just trying to get me very well. But I'm, um, I'm also very um, happy to take it slow um, because it's been gentle, and I need gentle and love and compassion. And nurturing which is what we've had all through the program so it's yeah I do feel um it's quite a shock really reading it back and seeing the changes and I remember in the process you know the frustrating moments that we had and you would say slow is fast slow <laughs> is fast and it's in our brains now for <laughs> condition <laughs> for life to know yeah, condition for life um and um it couldn't have been done any other way, Wendy. The way that you've, the way that you've made this program and writing the essay, I can see all the little pieces and how you've put it together and how they all interlinked. I wouldn't have got here by doing it any other way. And I know some people read your book and that's enough for them. But I know for me, and I can see, I remember how awful. I remember the first call when I phoned you in panic. <laughs> how awful um, it all was and um, it's only getting better. So I'm uh, feeling very grateful as well, and very blessed and proud. All those mixture of good feelings, just, just from, this is why you do the questionnaire, isn't it? So that we can look back and see, 
see the changes and um, recognise actually what's what's happened and the work it takes because you're right it's not easy so it takes a strong person to do it on their own like you did but unless you do the programme really and I don't see how you can really get to this stage because it's very easy to push ourselves too much because most of us have got that push apart and um, you know it's done very delicately and very lovingly and that's why though that's why we put our trust in with you through it i'm eternally grateful for all of your help i just oh, think and um, that's amazing really to see how um where i came from <laughs> make me cry <laughs> because, know, I know. Um, the emotion for you and yeah so it was awful it was destroying my life and my time is slow and my marriage it was hard so i i need to really celebrate where i am because i haven't done that at all not properly i've been um, quite ungrateful i think actually <laughs> So um, yeah, it's good to see that. It's good to to see that and remember where I started off, yeah. and to think how long I tried to manage that as well alone. It's nice now to have um, relationships with yourself and um, lovely Maxine. And, yeah, and uh, I think it's just having having someone to teach you and show you how that you have that within you. Um, I feel, again, it's like, I'm sad that I didn't have that growing up. I don't think my family are that way inclined to think that way. Um, but I feel it fits well with me. Um, I feel very fortunate to have met yourself um, and your team who show us that and give us a space to learn and understand that very, very gently, very lovingly, um, nurture it and um, because um, otherwise I don't think I would have fully understand it. It's not the same reading it from a book or something. It's, it's sharing the experiences together. My tools. Uh, because I was always expecting everything to be hard. Mm. I always expected yeah. it to be so much harder than that. And I was, and now I've obviously learned all my tools through the program. It's not, it's not hard to have, to remember what they are and to utilize them when I need them in the particularly difficult times. But I just expected it to be that way because I've always felt everything, you know, I've had to claw through mud to get to a good, a good spot. <laughs> I don't know really how to express it well. It's, let me think, best way. It's, it's incredible. You can't, I, it's invaluable, I would say. Um, you can change your whole life, your health. Um, do things that you didn't think you could do before it's just putting your faith into yourself and stepping out in faith and um just let each day take you as it comes but i'd say do it <laughs> do it you will never regret it <laughs> it's only going to bring you goodness <laughs> but the biggest thing i mean to be pain free and to be well which i imagine a lot of women who are c considering the 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 program it's because they want to be well and pain free um then yes that that happens and just for that i'd say do it but the journey will take you so much further than yeah. that it's it, you it's not just that it's not just that that comes with the journey <laughs> doesn't it wendy but it's much more it's much more than that what do you think your like top take right it would be well to be healed to be pain free like of course but that's not my wasn't that's not just my go-to now that that's um something that that's yes that's why I did it because I want to be well but along with it comes all this other treasure yeah, yeah treasure exactly for me that's mate that's been amazing for my confidence within myself um I think yeah it's been all it's been yeah really I feel like I feel like it's a stepping stone for me to be able to have confidence for the next thing. I, otherwise, I don't think, yeah, I would have had that. So well, just well, to have somebody say, yes, I know, but you've got this and I believe in you and you're where you're meant to be and you will be pain free. You will just to have hear those words 
because you don't hear them from anybody else. Everyone that we talk to through the programme that you bring in has been, they've been there, and they've been through it. And there's so many women that have been through it and they've all come out the other end well. Yeah. And I think that's the, it builds, a, it helps to build a trust, doesn't it? And a confidence, but to have that, somebody put that faith in you, especially at the time where you feel like it's never going to happen. <laughs> it's a very special, unique programme. There's nothing out there like it. And, and I would say if you if you want to get well and be pain free and have a healthy, happy body for the rest of your life, don't don't hesitate. Do the program, do what Wendy says, and um, learn to love yourself and have a different relationship with yourself and also those people around you. Build yourselves a better life because that's what it teaches you. And that's not what we're taught growing up. It's not what we're taught in schools. Uh, we should be, but we are not currently. Um, and um, it's, um, it is like, it is life changing experience. And it's worth, every step is worth it. And I'm very grateful that, that it's available. We're very fortunate it's available. And thank you, Wendy, for, for making it be available for us. <laughs> Don't use Wendy as your last hope, use her as your first hope. Yeah, <laughs> don't exactly. put yourself through all the stuff because you don't have to. <laughs> Thank you, Wendy, for, for making it be available for us. I'm sure it must be wonderful to see so many women come through and know that you've made a difference, haven't you? Yeah. It's been really lovely though, and um, I I really mean everything that everything that I've said. Um, so I hope that you feel really really good because you deserve you deserve it because you've done a lot of work so that we can have these better futures healthier <laughs> my pleasure you're giving me goosebumps you're making me all emotional <laughs> <laughs> well, look, thank you so much louise i really appreciate that oh you're welcome thank you very much